Okay, thanks for watching. This is a video to show you how to make a slide cast. A slide cast is simply a PowerPoint or other type presentation that you've paired audio for and made available for students or other people to download. So the first two things you need to do is to create an account somewhere where you can share your slides. Uh, a best example of where to do this at is a place called SlideShare. So you want to go to www.slideshare.net and once you're here you can create a free account. And also when you're on SlideShare you can search other people's presentations. So if there's a topic you're going to discuss in class you can actually find other people's work and sample it, share it, download it, edit it, remix it, do anything you want with it. So you create a SlideShare account. Then you're going to create whatever PowerPoint you have and you're going to have to find a way to record the audio. Uh, the easiest way on the Mac to record the audio is just to use GarageBand. So we'll go to GarageBand, click it down here in the dock, or if you don't have it on your dock, you can probably find it in Applications. So GarageBand is initializing. And then it's going to give us a menu here. We're going to say Create New Podcast. And we're going to give it a name. So it says Save Our New Podcast as call it practice podcast so we're going to create it do, do, do. it's opening here we go all right and now we're going to have to record whatever the audio is that we want to pair with whatever the slideshow that we have is so you just pick a voice track here pick mail for me and you hit record this button here and it starts recording what you say. So you say this is me recording my voice to pair with a practice uh, PowerPoint to help the faculty understand how to make a slide cast presentation that has audio. So we're showing them how to make the audio part. This is also how you would make any type of podcast. So we're done here. Hit stop. Now the tricky part is, is, is you will need to share this in a format that SlideShare allows you to pair with the presentation that you make. So you're going to go up here to Share, and you're going to want to pick this one right here, Export Song to Disk. And then you want to record it as an MP3, and that's usually the default here to compress it. So you hit Export, and then you're going to want to save it somewhere. We'll save it to the desktop. We'll call it Practice Podcast. We just hit Save. And you should see this menu come up here. It's creating the mix down go through a couple cycles of this to convert it to an mp3 file. So now it's done, so it saved it onto our desktop as an mp3 file. There it is, right there. And what we're going to do here is we're going to close out of GarageBand. Do we want to save it? Don't save. Uh, say no to that. So we'll just quit this. Okay. So here's our file, Practice Podcast MP3. Now we want to figure out a place that we can pair our audio with, and so a place where we can save our audio. But first, before we do that, let's upload our slideshow presentation that we made. Okay, so once you create your slideshow account, there's this place here that says Upload. So we're going to upload, and I made a practice PowerPoint earlier that we're going to upload. So let's go and find that real quick. So browse and select file put it on my desktop and I call it practice PowerPoint. So there it is. We're going to select that. And it's loading it, loading it, loading it, loading it, blah, blah, blah. There it is. It asks us to give it a name. We'll call it practice. Tags are what people are going to search for it by. So we can tag it any way we want. We can tag it practice, fun with slide share, PND. Give it a description. Then we say publish all. So you're going to see the status. Your slideshow is being converted and will be published shortly. You can see its current status here. So it's working on that. Now in the meantime, we're going to go to archive.org and upload our audio. A-R-C-H-I-V-E dot org. So we're going to upload our audio. So we've created our account. Once again, archive.org is completely free. So we're going to create our account. And uh, all we need to do here is go to Upload. So we go to Upload. 